Howdy folks, Grok the Duck Farmer here, and I'm on the Age of Engineering server, and I'm hiding here in the mining world from Thor, because he's a big meanie, and nobody likes him. He's streaming it? How about now? Are you live yet? <laughs> See? See? Are you there yet? He's a big meanie. <laughs> so, uh, Thor just finished his stream, and if you haven't been checking out uh, the other people st streaming here on the Age of Engineering servers, you're... you're crazy. You should be watching their stuff. Uh, Thor has been streaming a whole bunch and just did a whole bunch of uh, ME auto crafting stuff, which I love. That's that's great stuff. And Nonsanity also streams off on the server, and so you should be checking his stuff. And those guys are far ahead of me. I just barely hit age four. And you did eight yesterday. No, earlier today, didn't you, Thor? Um, one, two, three, four. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So, you know, he's he's twice as good as me, you know, but we knew that. And uh but anyway, I am uh, down here in the mining world because I've got my actual editions uh drill and I have loved this thing. It has been so much fun. Let me give you a quick idea of how much mining I've been doing recently. So, this down here was my first forays. And then I made this little drop shaft and, and did a little bit of, of mining. And then I got my, my drill <laughs> and have gone bananas with it. Oh, there's a little cave system must be right there. So I've, I've gone bananas with that. And I, I decided to stop right here because I was waiting for Thor. And diamonds, more diamonds. So let's go ahead and, and pound these diamonds away. And one of the things that I've been doing that has really really helped because you know I've got all random crap in here is this bag I love the pickup auto pickup from this bag I've got it set up here so I've got all the various ores that I've been picking up ooh 37 I that's a that's that's very good to see um, I've been picking up all sorts of stuff uh, while Thor has been streaming and just coming along here and going somebody up oh. <laughs> that was the end of the hallway I thought I was halfway through not all the way done they were just hiding right there. Well, here, let's, let's go check and see if there was any more hiding around here. Nope, nope. All right. Always worth uh, giving a quick check. And uh, so, been having a, a blast uh, mining here, doing that. And let's go ahead and head back home because I've got to process all this stuff. So let's uh, check out the, the stream. Uh, let's see. Anna, good to see you there. Kyoto, glad to have you here. Let's uh, jump into here, and I've got a little bit uh, off screen. I, I kept threatening to go ahead and make an electric furnace, and so I went ahead and did that. Oh, hey, Mr. Neocortex is in. So I've been tossing in the various things that need to be processed. Let's see, none of those. Why did all that go in and the lead nut go in? That looks like an insanity corner. Yeah, yeah. It's I, one of the things I want to do is actually fix this up, so it's it's not so so messy. Uh, but that that's a little bit later. Uh, so I can put here. Let's grab a bunch of stuff uh, from here. Oh, I'm so full of random crud. Let's get rid of. Uh, uh, not there. Let's dump it up here. So gravel's nice to have, but you know, not so much the rest of the things. All right. Now I've got room to move stuff about. So, uh, let's go ahead and grab these bits and dump them into here and let them start processing. And there's just, oh, there's three of us on the server since uh, Virtual Greg's in. How's the, yeah, the, the power is pretty much toast because I've been running two, sometimes three machines simultaneously. Uh, yeah, sometimes three, sometimes four <laughs> machines simultaneously. So that's been uh, a, a major slowdown. So let's improve that. Uh, I've got here eight more sa solar panels, so that will generate eight more RF per tick, which is very nice. But with this little puppy here, this will get me the low voltage solar array, which will get me, uh, should be doing eight per tick, uh, but it's in a single block, which is, you know, always nicer. Let's come over here. And I made a, an additional two. Let's go ahead and grab these guys. I didn't mean to break all of that. Uh, I've got to be careful now with this. So let's go ahead and grab these guys. Oh, my bag is full. Let's move out the lead. Get the lead out. And so if I 
crouch while picking it does one piece. And when I realized that, that was a thing, I figured at that point I was no longer needing pretty much any of the other bits and pieces that I, I had on me as far as uh, picks and whatnots. So I said, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm done with that. All right, let's, yeah, that's going in there. I think I will go ahead and replace these uh, small ones into big ones. <laughs> Thor is singing. <laughs> uh, let's see. You should hear his singing voice. It's a very nice singing voice. Yes, very nice. Yeah, very nice. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and plop this in here. And I decided to go ahead and move these out further. So here's one. And uh, although it's night, so that's not going to matter. Uh, you know, if Thor were really nice, he'd, he'd go ahead and sleep. But, you know, we, we no, don't want to toss that. I got the hint. Because <laughs> I will be there in a short second. Did I... Oh, did you realize what I just did? I was a extreme dummy, and I broke IC2 stuff without a wrench. <clears throat> and I made the wrench specifically so I'd stop doing that with myself. Oh, hey, Virtual Greg beat me to the uh, the, the the bed. All right, so um, yes, I will I will have to fix that, and I, I don't think I want to fix that right now because that was uh, dumb of me. But that will uh, I will have two of these guys right here, and I should. Where's my sand? Can't wait to see what you're gonna do with the reactor. Uh, I'm gonna blow up the reactor. That's what I'm gonna do. Because you know that's what one does with the reactor. Now, what I, machines did she lose? Those were the the eight solars I had there. I had the second oh. set of eight. Yeah, I had the second set of eight that I had already done, and so I was just sitting there going, "Ah, what a dummy!" But that's okay, because I I know where Thor has his base and where he's been uh, keeping his stuff, and so I'm just gonna go in there and raid his because he's not here listening, so he doesn't know what I'm going to be doing. Nope, I didn't want to do that there. Nah, uh, it's just a little glass yeah. and circus. It's not too bad. No, it's it's not bad. I will start that going. Let's take a quick look here. To make these, uh, I already, I've got all of these made, and I've got all this in place, so I just need to make uh, two of those circuits. So let's start some copper uh, chopping up. Uh, let's see, I'm going to need eight, sixteen of those, and each one of those is going to need a whole ton of, of, let's just squeeze out a whole bunch of wires, because I'm going to be needing a bunch of them. So let's turn that into extrude. I'm, let's see, do I have any, I don't have any of the metal plates here, so we will uh, fiddle with that. Let's give this a little bit more power here. That's why I stuck the hopper in here, so this would feed in stuff and that would uh, feed in stuff there into the bat box. But that's one of the plans for today, is to increase the power. Because I'm using more things, I need the power to come up. And so I'm, I'm hoping that, uh, that uh, the, the two solar arrays will definitely help to, uh, with that. So, while those uh, solars are, are slowly grinding their way through, uh, I do need some iron. I'm going to need uh, 16 of them plates. All right, uh, let's take a look while I'm doing it. Yeah, everybody everybody noticed that I had done it, but nobody said it fast enough for me. Uh, let's see, Heinz looks like he's joined the stream first time. Well, hey, glad to have you here, Heinz. And uh, Daniel MC is here. And Tyler, how howdy, welcome all to the stream. So we're, yeah, uh, another example of dumb. This right here, this is iron that got squeezed into uh, cables when what I really wanted was to do, not do extruding, but f the flattening them with the hammer. Ah, which is why eventually I'm going to have three of these. One dedicated to hammering, one dedicated to cutting, and one dedicated to extruding. Which is what I really, really like to have, but I don't have at this point. Because uh, more power, gotta have more power. Uh, so this is grinding away. I I really wonder why it seemed like it stopped. It 
Oh, there's gravel in there. Let's not have gravel in there. Let's see. More bauxite can go into here. Oh, nope, it's full. All right. We'll just keep pushing things along. Just an FYI. Yes. I did it in the beginning, too. That's why I have a couple thousand aluminum. <laughs> but I have done that in every on. series I've ever done. It has always caught me and bit me in the butt. Later on, you don't want to process your box set anymore. Yes, I heard um, about that. Because you're going to turn it in the... Oh, shoot. Let me check. Is I think it's for chrome? titanium. Oh, the titanium. Yeah, there. in the industrial grinder, you get bauxite dust. And then that one you use to make in the elect industrial electrolyzer. And then you get small piles of titanium dust. Which is going to be handy to have. So those go there. I need more coal. Fortunately, I did some. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna follow Kyoto's uh, good suggestion and make blocks and macerate that up because it's so much faster. All right, so let's go ahead and macerate here. That can go here along with the lead, and that'll get us the. See, that's so much faster than even a single piece. At least to me, it seems like it's faster. Maybe just because I've. I think it's them. the same speed, but it's just you know you're gonna get nine, <laughs> which is so much better, <laughs> so much better than than just one at a time. So let's go ahead and snag those. That might be all that I need, but uh, you know, Wild was saying that he was making lots and lots and lots of everything that he was making, which which is a a good thing to do, you know, when you've got the the bits and pieces. And I'm, I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to have more of all the, the bits and pieces to, to do stuff, which is good. Once you have a void ore miner, that's oh. when you're like, all right, let's make 16 at a time or something yes. like that. I am so looking forward to having a void ore miner. I, I really do like the, the engineering um, tech. That is, is a very fun mod for me. Um, all, the, all the stuff that, that comes along with that. Uh, I need iron. I've got my iron. Let's squish me some iron for right now. You can stop. Do that. And I th think that's pretty much all I need. Oh, I've got to turn these into cables. Let's grab a stack of those oh, and throw away the, <laughs> the copper dot pipes. Pipes? Cables. All right, let's go ahead and stick you in here. And I don't need that many, but that allows me to go like this. I'm going to need 16, which tells me I need more. So um, that might be enough. I just kind of grabbed a stack. OK, still running out of power. Yep, let's uh, grab some more wood. I've been using that to kind of supplement when I've been needing the, the quick burst of power. And I stuck the wood down in here. Yeah, let's grab two stacks. I went ahead and created a few things. So I made a tool forge uh, that was 36 steel, but I, this gave me the, 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 the lumber axe so that I could go ahead and chop down the, the, the trees all at once. And for those who care, um, I went with the bone for the handle because that was a, a 1.1 multiplier which was not bad uh, copper for the binding so that gives me XP uh, I also went with a stone for the plate and mm, cobalt for the the, the, the actual ha headpiece so it can repair with stone and also repair with experience because I threw on the, the mending moss and that that's that's pretty good let's see so oh yes I was going to throw some power into here. All right, this is finished squishing. This is very slowly squishing because it's everything else is taking up power. All right, let's go ahead and pull out these for right now. They don't need to uh, get processed right at this moment. And, you know, technically these don't need to either. Let's go ahead and grab the polar update out there. 
That'll... That'll hold off, and that will give me more power over to here. Yes, so now that's that's going up. Alrighty. One of the things I'd like to, to fix is, is not having to worry about having too many things running, and I should not have my lumber axe in my hand when I'm doing that. Uh, Daniel asks, uh, fractured damages yourself as well? Um, I don't believe so. I've, I've had that on swords, and it, it, it improves the damage dealt, and so that's, uh, that's just fine. So, um, we just need to, the stuff to, to process through. Oh, there's eight plates. That's not all of them that I need, but that's a, a good start. And let's go ahead and make some of those. That's half that we need. All right. Is my wrench in here? Yes, yeah, see, there's my wrench. I made that really early on so that I would have it for moving these, these uh, systems. <sighs> so, oh well. Let's see. Let's sort that. Get those redstones out of the way so we don't need that. Um, let's check here. Yes, that, and then, oh, we need to talk. No, 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 no. We wait until this is done, and then we'll switch yes, this yes, over. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> yes, 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 no, no, maybe. Uh, so we'll make, try not to make uh, more mistakes. So, let's see. Mr. Neo Cortex says that Mechanism is one of his favorite mods. Mechanism is fun. I do love the Digital Miner. That is fantastic for getting just what you want. Um, but we, we've had some, some issues with mechanism as far as, as killing server performance. And so that was, that was rather painful. So let's, let's go ahead. I'm going to need lots of copper, so I'm going to go ahead and just process all of these things. Because why not? Uh, Wild Rascal's checking on his bees. Bees for everybody! Bees! So there's the other plates we need. Yep. Daniel says he likes uh, Thaumcraft. I I kind of liked Thaumcraft. I I wasn't extremely wowed with Thaumcraft. Uh, the 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 mini game was one of those things I was going, eh. That that's more of grief than than fun. You know, once you've you've done it multiple times, you kind of go, eh. But uh, I I liked the things you could How do. How do you with go? It. Eh. Maybe a meh, a little M in there too. <laughs> My problem with Thumbcraft, I love Thumbcraft, uh, but only if you have Thumbic Energistics. I do like to do everything in the beginning with the golems and stuff. It's fun, but then later on, it's just a pain in the butt. Yeah. But. What my biggest problem with that mod was that for as much time and so on you need to put in it, the end results were just very underwhelming compared to like Botania and Blood Magic. Mm -hmm. You know, um, that's that's the problem I have. Those wands and stuff, I think they should do more damage. Um, they should. They, the, um, yes. They, they power seem... four bow does twice as much damage as a stupid wand. Yeah, and you can get one of those real early on too. Yeah. So. So yeah, it's for the amount of work put in to get well those wands with the, the focus on it, and it, yeah, it doesn't make sense that it, it's as wimpy as it, as it ends up being. But I, I do like the the tainted biome. I I, I like that one, um, and I I've... I also like the dungeon and stuff. It's it's a fun mod. Mm -hmm. Yep. So there's my eight. All right, so let's go ahead and repair my my stupidity from the beginning of the stream. There, I've got a second low voltage array. Let's get some more dirt. Do I have dirt? I do have some more dirt. Good. See, it, I'm gonna blame you, Thor, for for being there and jostling my elbow. Yep, yep. <laughs> so you're gonna be checking your bees too. Oh. <laughs> So, that should give me quite a lot more EU kicking along, which will definitely help the process here. Now, the other thing that I was looking at is, oh, I should take my battery and toss that into there, so that gets charged up. So, the, uh, 
the idea of, of having more EU coming in from the solars is, is a great one. It's a very permanent, um, not permanent, it's a very um, always on, you know, when it's daytime sort of uh, trickle in uh, energy source, which, which I like. Uh, but what I am really wanting is to store more because if we take a look at this bat box, and I've got four of them, they can hold uh, 40k of, of EU and if they're all fully charged that's 160 K but that's not enough and so the thing I was looking at doing is making an MFE because the MFE will hold uh, count become that's 4 million EU which is far better than what I've currently got so uh, if we look at these it's energy absolutely worth it Oh, I'll tell you. oh yeah, I'm I'm looking at that and saying I really really need this. So um, especially when you're AFK and, mm -hmm. or offline and that thing charges and you got four million EU waiting for you in the beginning. That is so good. That's exactly why I've been hunting for diamonds because oh a total of sixty four. Well cool um, because it takes sixteen diamonds to make one of these MFUs because it, each one of these energy crystals requires four diamonds to be chewed up and so I, I had zero diamonds when I started or when I ended the last stream so I said okay 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 let me let me get some more and I'll, I'll make two of these I figure that's uh, probably a good thing to do and so I need to macerate these guys yes yes <laughs> thinking about it for a second you know do I really want to destroy my diamonds yes Yes, let's macerate those. Uh, I need to make some basic of the the basic interface, not interfaces, casings, casings. Yeah, that's just the the iron. So I got sixteen more iron here. So let's go ahead and squish that all up. Uh, the copper can stop, and you can squish that. Okay, so we got a bunch more cable, which is good. Because I, I keep finding that I need more and more, especially since I've been doing some of the um, the, the bits that require um, was it the the coil. So that's eight copper wires around uh, an, an iron ingot in the center, and so I've been chewing up through my copper. You can see I've hardly any copper. I've got a copper block here. Oh, I keep forgetting this copper block because it looks almost the same as the bronze. So one of the things I'm tempted to do is reprocess everything through my my electric furnace over there so that I have everything looking the same as opposed to you know you look at these aluminum ingots here let's I kind of like that that pale greenish blue look and here's aluminum ingots through the other well that also works because aluminum is is a very very bright metal so you know that makes sense Lots more copper. Lots more copper. So I've been I've been proceeding through uh, messing up. Not messing up. Uh, yes, I have been messing up. I've been proceeding through um, processing all my my ores so that I can get you know everything set up and done and working there, which is what I've been trying to do. Anyway, so um, talking about you know passive power. That's the word I was looking for. Passive, passive power like the the solar generation or the water mill that's uh, hiding underneath uh, that area over there, those are, are fantastic because they just are always running. But power storage is really, really critical. Having, while that's continually running, while I'm AFKing, while I'm offline and, and this chunk is loaded, having it continually trickle feed these, these storages is fantastic. So that's why I've been wanting to make the MFEs and for that, I need these insulated gold cables. I think that's one each. So that's one, two, three, four. So that's four gold I'm going to need to do. One, two, three, four. And as near as I can tell, I can't do more than two out of the gold, which is a, a pain because I'd like to be able to do far more than that. All right, what else is eating up? Oh. This is getting up a little bit because I'm still making steel. Wait, I thought gold gives you four cables. Does it give me four cables? Well, that'd be even better. I think gold does, yeah. Here, let's, let's take a quick look. Uh, not the macerator. The metal former. So if it's extruded, then it's four. The, the plate, if I take the plate and run it through the former, it also gives me four if I cut it. 
So it makes sense to extrude it for that it's one process. So okay, I only need two gold, which is even better. Because I don't have gobs and gobs of gold. But I do have some. Wait a second. Did you just did you just see that? That was the, the chest with my other items over here. Or was it? I, yeah, I, I saw a weird, weird thing there for a split second. That was really, really weird because those were ingots. Okay, I'm... I'm seeing yeah, things. Blame the game. I'm mm -hmm. gonna blame the game because it all of a sudden I saw ores in there plus the um, plus my two ingots that I tossed in and I uh, was going. Duh, wah, ah. Oh well. Anyway, uh, see that is grinding along. Uh, we are almost close to be able to make one. Uh, let's go ahead and as soon as that's done. Yoink. Let's go ahead and... No, I don't want a hammer. I want to extrude. Let's get these two going really quick. That's enough to do one. All right. So, Mr. Neocortex just poured himself a drink. Well, I'm going to take a drink. Oh, yeah. Mm. So, um, yeah, uh, Orenzo, uh, the, this is a, a private server, but... Um, the the nuts and bolts, which is very much a um, expert mode sort of you know difficult enhanced uh, recipes uh, mod that is not mod mod pack that is um, available for the FTOG community so that definitely uh, can can go in there and um, so you can uh, go to ftog.net and uh, put in an application you will uh, be able to join the uh, nuts and bolts server. I've been doing several things on there, which has been lots of fun. Let's see, 2x in insulated gold cable. Let's triple check 2x insulated gold cable. Okay, I just wanted to triple check to make sure I was actually doing that. Uh, welcome, Brad. Welcome to the stream. You, you, you missed me uh, derping up uh, terribly in the, more, uh, the very beginning, and I blame Thor. So... <laughs> Let's see. Do, 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 do. So I've got enough here to do the first one. So let's do that. I need redstone and these. So let's grab some redstone. Uh, let's grab two just in. Oh, I already had some in my inventory in the corner. I didn't notice. All right. So the diamonds go there, and then the the rest of the redstone goes all around so that will give me nine this will compress into one of those so let's grab all those and we've got that ready for there and let's squish these in the compressor and that should give me four of those very nice um, uh, energy energy crystals I think is the yep energy crystals I need the machine casing and the wire so let's go ahead and put the wire in and I've got enough for one machine casing that's being used so let's use this there's my basic and I'm glad it's the basic so I just need those wait for you to get squished so there's two done nice how are you doing power wise ah see that's uh, that's had enough that it's filled this one up which is good that way these are going at their full speed. All right. Go, 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 go. It's like I spend so much time just waiting for things to happen here. All right. And the nice thing is I don't have to charge these because that would be a pain. All right, there's my MFE. Very, very, very nice. Oot. And let's uh, come over here and grab my wrench so I don't make a horrible mistake. Uh, this guy can go away. And then let's put a block right here. And then, <laughs> can I get back there now? <laughs> All right, let's, 
Uh, no, 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 no. Let's. If I'm going to break this, I'm going to break this by hand and not with my my nifty new drill, which will do all sorts of damage with things there. Perfect. Perfect. Ouch. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Is that... Oh, was that... Tin? Oh, it was just because I was standing on the cable. Really? The restart is paused. Thank you. Uh, two of the cables look like they're gone, but there were others back here that I can see. One, two, three. So maybe I... It, it's, it's an insulated... Um... Oh, wait a second. Uh, Heinz says, I will need a transformer or the machines are going to go boom. Wait a second. It's supposed to be just going out in regular power. Why is that? What is, what, what? Yeah, From um, the MFE to what? To I was going to run um, the, the copper, insulated copper wires to the machines. Everything will go boom, buddy. Right click the MFE right now. And it's going to tell you how much it's coming out. Ah, uh, so that's far higher than... Then the it cables would... will blow up in your machines. Mm -hmm. Now well, that would explain it. Well, this explains why I've never normally done these. All right, so I need a better cable. The you actually need two transformer. You need an MB and an LB. All right. You need to go from five twelve to one twenty eight, and then down to thirty two. So five twelve. The cables can transfer 128, but that just means the packet size. Mm -hmm. The machines are tier one. They can only accept a max of 32. All right. So this one, I need an MV transformer. That will step it from the 512 it's making down to the, the 128. And then where's the other transformer? Oh, this one, the LV transformer. There it goes. Okay. So I've made this, I've, I've made several of those already. Ah, ready? Well, that means this is in an unuseful spot. So it's a, you know, I've not had, I'm trying to think when I had these in place that it was working. Uh, the last time I did a lot with the, the IC2 stuff was back with um, Feed the Beast uh, Infinity. Hmm. That was okay. the last time I did a lot as well. Yeah. yeah. So it's it's been a, a definite while. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, break all that. Come on, break. That Transformers are cheap to make, though. Yeah, because what I was looking at doing is burying some of this stuff down below so that um, I'm not at, you know, I can keep the, the this little bat box here and then I can um, have the, the transformers down below. So let's plop that there. There's my little bat box. That goes there. All right, let me grab two more cables. Uh, one, two. This way, at least the uh, the daylight will continue to charge things up. Yeah. All right, so that's going there. Then I need to go ahead and fix things down here. Okay, this will actually work. All right, so you can see I've got. Let's. I'm. I, I've got too much wood and, and stuff. I don't want to break it all up here with. But so you got you can see I've got the, the the various of these small bat boxes in here to hold. But that's not certainly as as much as I need. So let's go ahead and dig much further down. That should be filled in too. Now the actually I should make the other two pieces. Let's see. So if I have right now, let's go ahead and put that cable back here. Because I'm thinking of running the cable here, then I can have 
my MFE here feeding into the the first step down, second step down cable. Uh, actually, no, I can have this one down at the bottom and then feeding up. So that's what we're going to do. All right. I got rid of my my small axe, which would made this easier to get back up. Okay, so let's make the LV transformer. I need the uh, more copper and that and that. I've got all that. All right, so I've got one, two of you. I need an iron from over here. Iron sort and copper wire. I think I brought back here. I did. So I just need eight of these. One more. Let's go. Nope. <laughs> Let's use my crafting table on a stick. Okay, so iron in the center, that goes around, there's my coil, there's my two pieces here, and then put that there. So this is the low to high, so now I need to make this one. That's just machine casing, and, oh, that's, yeah, you're saying it's cheap? Yeah, that's very cheap. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll just hammer those out. Are you? Yeah, you're in hammer mode. Alrighty. I've got enough diamonds. Oh, I was going to do two of those. So let's go ahead and actually... It would be nice to be able to see what the power is on those. Which is why I, I liked having one here. Because then you could just look at it and say, oh yeah, it's fully charged. But, oh well. So let's come back to here. This diamond dust goes into there. Let's compress all those. Um, yes, I'm going here to compressor, but it's doing that. Uh, I got distracted because uh, Brad said he suggests that um, do it have a cable in between each item so I can tap a higher power line with whatever level I want later without having to redo. You know, that's a pretty good idea there. But um, I'm, I'm thinking for, for right now, um, I do plan on tearing out all the, the basement below because I've, I've done that down here with uh, the, the water wheel and there's a, a small cave system down here. I was thinking of going ahead and some of the bigger machines that, that need a lot more, those multi-block machines are going to need more space. So I was thinking something like a seven or eight tall um, area work area down here so that that gives me uh, plenty of space to access stuff up there so for right now I'm, I'm okay with just throwing these together for for the bits that I need and I didn't need to jump down there I needed to come to the compressor all done perfect let's grab those are also all done nice all right, so let's go ahead and I needed to make, I think I needed to make two of these. This one goes here and with those, and that's the second MFE, okay. And then the transformer also needed the, the one. So I figured I'd check before I use something that I didn't need. And yes, I do have the two there. There's my transformer. All right, so now we can take this one and put it right there. So looking at it, it's grabbing the power from, from the other side, which is very nice. All right, and now we need this. I think just to be on the safe side, I'm going to pop these guys off and you just so that uh, I'm on the not breaking things. So there's the 512 to 128. No. I had the wrong thing selected. All right. MFE right there. And then the transformer right there. And I'm assuming like everything else, the in and there's just the one out. And then this transformer 
I want it to point up. All right. And oh, I forgot that I was going to do two, and that's why it's over one, two soon. Yeah, let's just uh, knock them back one. Actually, they don't have to go back one as much as I can send. Yeah, why not? You go here. And you come off, and you go there, and then you go there, and then you come out, and you go here. So now this bat box goes there, and where's my other bat box? That one right there. Nope. All right, so that should do me for power. So now let's go ahead and get rid of these bits. And I just need the one cable here. So let's go ahead and put you right there. So that should, yep, it's got 38 EU coming in. Is it, it's night. How is that doing 32? Oh, unless it was uh, the, the power that was there and it's now coming across. That, that's got to be what, what was happening there. All right, so let's uh, tidy things up here a little bit. Alrighty, so here I can do a quick sleep. There we go. Easy, easy, no problem. All right. Oh, uh, saying the inputs are backwards. Okay, that makes them completely different from all the other. The five holes are input, the single hole is output. So let's go ahead and fix that real quick. Alright, so you. Let's pull both of you out. Okay, so then I just put them in the other way around. This one goes alar, like that, and this one goes alar. And so now, yes, now it's racing up the power. There we go, there we go. Alrighty. You know, it would be nice if they used the, the, the blue and orange that has become kind of standard in uh, modded Minecraft. But, you know, oh well. You live I think IC2 has been around a little longer. Uh, yeah, but uh, I'm I'm used so to this. So they're probably saying, you know what, you adjust to five holes in one hole. <laughs> <laughs> you do it our way, and you will like it. All right. So which one? This is the. That is the right one. And doot, having these guys. I can't okay. believe how overpowered this nutrition module is. How much power are you getting from? Oh, oh, oh! The the calculator. Oh, I just never need to eat again, mm -hmm. and it sucks it out of a tree. Mm -hmm. Right? Well, you know that's kind of the way food is. You just suck it out of a have tree. Have you right? eaten? And have you sucked the tree? Like, um, and then start sucking? No. Well, uh -huh. you know, maple syrup, but you know, other than that, no. I think that takes a little bit more refining. <laughs> well, you, you you can if if you don't want the the, the straight goodness. Oh, actually, uh, that is exactly what I want to come in there. So pipe. Uh, let's grab my little wrench. Don't do that. All right, so, um, no, not you. You go there. All right, so that can go in. How's this going? This is almost done. You know, I think I might snag, no, all my steel or iron is over here. Let's see. Oh, hey, the the laundry fairy just joined. I, I should be uh, nice and, and uh, kind to her, otherwise uh, she will uh, beat me up. I got your back. Oh, good. Thanks. Thor's got my back, so you know, even if you uh, tear me up. Uh oh. 
Yeah, she is pointing out the fact that she does have a cutlass, and it is a fully functional cutlass. Wait, is that Mrs. the Duck Farmer? Mm-hmm. I don't have your back. She scares me. Uh, <laughs> he says that uh, he, he doesn't have my back because you scare him. <laughs> uh, yes. All right, so uh, distracted, distracted. Um, we've got the, the, the power going, so we've got... For 8 million RF plus 160K of max storage so that these little solar uh, arrays out there, as power comes in, we'll go ahead and, and, um, and process all that and, and do what we need. And if everything is all messed up and completely you know out of power, I can throw stuff into here. And again, I should really be careful about clicking that with something that could break it. Um, the The power can come into here and process through and and do the the stuff that needs to be done. All right. So what's going on? That's fine there. Oh, again, stop clicking with things that could break it. Uh, the macerator and the rest I could turn back on. You know, I think at this point I won't. Uh, yeah, yeah, that would that would be bad to put uh, something block my my solar uh, panels there. Uh, and then watch you for a two-hour stream so trying to figure out why, why you lose power. Is this not working. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and the the sad thing is that explosions are are disabled because otherwise, you know, I I, I did blow up uh, Samsel's base, you know, out in the, the 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 void area, and that that worked out very nicely. But uh, you know, as as a mistake. So, um, you know, could, accidents could happen. Alrighty, so um, this all then is much, much better power stuff. Yeah, mistake. Um, this is much better uh, power setup as far as storing the power, and I've got the two solar arrays, so now I've got uh, double the, um, the, the input, actually a little bit more than double, because when I left the, the, the stream last, I had six. And now I've got the equivalent of 16, so much better, much better. Uh, let's go ahead and charge up my poor wrench, because sad. Wait, I didn't know you're married to a pirate. Oh yes, she is. Uh, she is very, very piratical. Yep. All right, and let's see. So yeah, let's do this thing. Uh, yes, it's a it's a long and sordid tale. Would you like to regale the people with uh, the reasons why? Reasons why what? Well, why you're you're a pirate. It takes too long to explain. Just suffice to say that I'm piratey. Okay, she's piratey. So, because uh, she she refuses to explain. I can see her standing behind you with a cutlass and an eye patch. <laughs> uh, she has an eye patch too. Mm -hmm. You know, she doesn't wear it every day, but she also has an eye patch. I do. So. Oh, that's Mother hilarious. Made it for me. It's awesome. All right, so um, she's distracting me again. Yes. So uh, I don't need that transfer anymore, and I don't need the MFE because that's taken care of. What else do I have? Uh, the low voltage solar array has been taken care of. So uh, power wise on this side, I think is, is really good. I may come back and look at this again as far as rearranging this, but let's get power going over here. Now this is all the, the RF side of things. So, um, I went ahead and I had put four of these uh, LV capacitors underneath this because that's that's where the, the capacitors are going to go. But the suggestion last time was to, to upgrade these and to have much, much stronger capacitors. Uh, lead. Let's go ahead and process all the lead. I'm going to need lots of lead. So let's do that. Process, process, process. All right, so um, looking at the, I want to make one of these thermoelectric generators, but I want to store power. So let's store power first. I want to make five of these HV capacitors. Now to make that, I'm going to need steel, got lots of steel, um, got aluminum ingots, no problem. Blocks of lead, that's why I need to push the lead through. Uh, and then I need these MV capacitors and redstonia crystal blocks. So now to make the MVs, I need another Redstonia. And then to make these LVs, which I've got some of, I also need Redstonia more. So I'm going to need lots of Redstonia, which is good that I actually grabbed some. So uh, I didn't necessarily want to do that. I wanted to actually 
Pop. I held down the key so that I would crouch and it wouldn't chew these things up. I call shenanigans. Uh, Alright, so let's go ahead and just stick those there. So I need five and each one, that means 10 MVs, which means 20 of these LVs. Now I've got four, five, six, so I need to make 14 more of these LVs. All right, check my math again. I want five HVs, 10 MVs, 20 LVs, four, five, six. Okay, so yes, so that's 14, yeah. Math on, well, streaming is, is a terrible thing to do because uh, it makes you make mistakes, let me tell you. That's a bad thing. All right, so let's uh, start that processing through. So that's 16 more of these. No, no, that's 14 more of these. See, math. Uh, Thor's giving out the, the lottery numbers for the next week. That are trying to confuse me. I'm just trying to confuse you. <laughs> that's not happening. I already, you, 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 your window of time was, was very short and you missed up. Uh, it wasn't uh, fast enough, so let's actually I was put... about to start counting in voice, but I'm like, no, nah, that's just going to mess him up. <laughs> well, I'm used to just kind of pretty much ignoring you, so I've got many years of ignoring Mrs. the Duck Farmer, so, uh, you know, let's... Uh oh now I'm in trouble. Um, no, I listen to her attentively for everything she says, and pro tip, you should always listen to your wife. And brown nose are good. And brown nose are good. So, uh, so redstonia, I need 14 of these. Then let's take a look at what I need for the LVs. So LVs, copper, lead, iron, and treated. So that's not a problem. There's a ton of copper there. Uh, iron is over here, and so is the treated. All right. Let's grab this. I've been ignoring chat for far too long. You guys are probably talking about all sorts of things like getting drunk. Whiskey, Let's see. Actually. Oh, yeah, see. Lots and lots of whiskey. Um, solar. Alcohol. Yeah. All right. Let's grab this. <laughs> thanks Have for hanging. Fun, rock. Yep, thanks Catch for hanging. Catch you later. Yep, yep, yep. See ya. Yar. Yar. <laughs> All right. I'm going to need to make some more treated wood. I can tell I need to make some more treated wood really soon. So let's go ahead and do a stack there. I'm having clicking problems like crazy today. All right. So that's in place for this. And... I needed the, let's look at these things again, because mine like a steel trap. Okay, that's where the lead goes and the iron. So let's go ahead and grab some lead. I have some, yes, I do have some lead here, and I still have some iron. All right, so 14 of you. That's, oh, that is enough. All right, so there's my 14 uh, LV capacitors, which is great. So now I need to make MVs. Those need electrum and more iron and lead. Okay, so lead can go there. This needs electrum and a lot more iron. Let's go ahead and I had compressed them into blocks just because I was getting enough iron. I was going to finally enough iron. Uh, so let's do that. I only need 10. So let's limit with that. All right, so now electrum is gold and silver. And I'm going to need 10 MVs, so I'm going to need uh, probably uh, 20 uh, gold and 20 silver, if I am doing the math right. Let's see. There's that. Uh, Electrum. Smelty, no. I want to furnace this so that comes from there. Oh, come on. So back one. I want to make the alloy smelter. That tells me. So it's one to one, and that makes two. 
Ah, okay, so I just need 10 of those and 10, it, 10 silver. So let's go ahead and grab, there's silver. And one, two, three. So there's my 10 silver and 10 gold. And let's see, just me and Greg, so let's, uh, I'll sleep real quick and use that as an excuse to get some water here. Now, Brad's saying that one plus one makes two. Um, the the problem is that some of the times with like uh, ardite and with um, ardite and uh, cobalt, you put them together and you get one. Nah. And so that that's that's an issue. At least it's been the the last time I made magnilingalingalum, uh, and uh, that that uh, took a while. All right, so silver, electrum. Molten gold, let's push the electrum to the bottom, and that's processing along. It, it's kind of cool that it's not an instant process, because that makes sense. You know, it would make sense that you, you pour in the two metals and then you gotta stir them around for a while. It you know, it, it makes sense that it's got a process. So let's go ahead and turn that on and make some ingots for me. I need more redstonia. I need ten more blocks, and then I'll need five more blocks after that. So that's another 15. It's a good thing I did a whole bunch of mining because I was getting kind of low on redstone too. Not no more. Yay, redstone yeah. All right. Infinitesimals, which is a fun word to say and is a high scrabble word as well. So let's go ahead and I yeah at this point I need to make more. Uh, creosote and oh, I had a bucket right there. Let's grab that. Where's my crafting table on a stick? Not you. There's some more. All right. I'm looking at putting more here. I need 15. I need some more. Eventually, I will get this process automated as far as making the, the the treated wood, but I've not had a major need for it up to this point. But, you know, I'm going to need more. Yep, yep. Let's make another batch. Oh, nope, that finished pouring, so I've got my electrum. Where's my electrum? There's my electrum. And you whoop, go right there. Uh, oh, no, I don't need treated here. This is where my capacitors go. That's where they go. And I need three, six more. I need you. And then I need these two down here. You and you. And let's fall the way down. All right, did I get everything? I think I got everything. That was a pretty good little fall. Did I get everything? I did. All right. So that's the, the remaining bits I needed. Uh, that may be an issue for crafting with them. Because uh, they're not going to stack with the rest of these. Yeah, they're, they're not stacking because these have, have uh, had stuff done to them. All right. So let's get these seven out. And then these. And then those. All right, so there's my 10 MVs, and those go there. All right, so now for the HVs, steel. I need steel, no longer the iron. Then go away. And now I need uh, ingots, and there's five of these, so I don't have enough of the, the lead to, uh, to make the ingots I need. Or not ingots, I'm thinking blocks. So I need five. Five. All right. Let's see here. So those five go there, and I already forgot that I need the aluminum. All right. So aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. So I need ten of those. Those go there, and then steel. I'm going to need twenty-five steel. Hey, that's, that's enough right there. Oh, let's get just what we need. Alright, 
so that. Wait a second, I got 25. Oh, I need 15 because I can math. All right, so there's my five pieces right there. And these, I need to go gadoink, 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 gadoink. Uh, these blue is in, and I want those on the top to be out. So where's my hammer? I don't see my hammer. Is it up in here? There it is. All right, so these all need to get turned into orange, so they're all outs there. All right. Oh, fine, you're going to break these individually instead of all <laughs> all right stop that let's eat some lots of things all right uh, a wrench who needs a wrench when you know you can just chew them up all right so let's go ahead and uh, put you there and you there and you there and you there now each of these whole what happened to my fifth one? One, two. I had f five. I had five. What happened to my fifth one? You you saw I had five. They were laid down here four and the one out. Uh, now I am. Hmm. It, it, they don't break. I've I've worked with them before. They don't break. They shouldn't break. All right. Oh, <laughs> here's my fifth one. It got inserted on top of the display stand. Ah, okay, that makes me feel better because I I didn't want to spend the time and effort to go through and no, I didn't want to go all the way down. I didn't want to spend the time to uh, do that again. You also put your keys in the fridge, don't you, Brock? Uh, only sometimes. Okay, no, I never have put my keys in the fridge. That would be dumb. So now these are blue, so those are the in. So the power is going to come in from the bottom on these. All right, all right. And then this one's already set to be an output on the top. Uh, this is an LV wire array, which is going to do us no good. And there's the phone that should never ring. All right, let's also break that one. Hello? And then we have to drop down here to get that again. And down here. Okay, so I'm going to need... Because I don't... Now, now, I'm, now I've got to sit there and think again. Can I input the, the LV power into an HV capacitor... I don't think I can. I think I have to HV it the, the whole way, thinking about it. Hmm. Do I have blocks? I do have blocks. Let's go ahead and pillar up and put that in place. All right, so that should be... Actually, I'm going to put it right up there, I think, is a good spot for it. Right there. All right, so then blue for going in, and we should be good there. All right, so no, I, I'm not going to chop down my wheel. That would be bad. Brad says I can take it out and in with that. I, I was thinking that L, the HVs only, it was HV all the way through, because, again, it's been Feed the Beast and in Infinity. Uh, expert mode that was the last time I did a lot of stuff with uh, with this but um, I, I am thinking it would be nice to have HV wires through here so that I can pump out the, the, the power as, as much as possible um, although at this point because I have uh, like zero um, really fast energy coming in it really doesn't matter so this was right there Let's go ahead and uh, try this. So that, and an LV cable here, or that's a wire, not a cable. And let's put 
one there and one there. Actually, let's test and make sure that this will work all the way over to the other side. Did you go into my bag? You did. Uh, let's see. Right here. Boink. Wire, wire. That went all the way across. And there. Oh, I know why. Because there's no power going on down below. <laughs> All right, so that needs a, do I have another, I, I popped this one, oh no, I didn't pop that one off, but that, bit, bit, I must be missing one that was on the bottom side of that. Where did that go? I'm no sure. All right, I will need to make at least, let's use this guy here just so we can cl complete the chain. And then I'll need to make some more uh, LV wire. When I upgrade the amount of power going in, then I'll need to have uh, stronger wires. But for right now, that should be sufficient. Oh, obstructed. Fine. And let's try that now. Let's do this. No. No, no, there, there, oh, still obstructed. Quit washing me away. Let's, <laughs> I'm making nothing but a mess here. All right, let's contain the water so I can make it easier for me to move. Yeah, I'm killing the light sources too. All right, you should not be updating either. So now let's try that and that. Yay! All right. So now we can go ahead and restore all the stuff I broke. Let's see, that's one of you and one of you. And I need a cobble there and there's some dirt that uh, goes there. All right. That's working. And I'm afraid to use the axe that close to the water wheel because I don't want to have to redo the, the water wheel. So, yeah, yeah, see, Brad recognized it was the dirt that was the problem. I was thinking it was directly below, but it's not. It's one over. Why is the dirt even blocking it when the wire is going through and not being in? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let's grab the torch here. Always light things up. Alrighty, so um, this is a much, much better setup as far as storing vast quantities of power because I need, again, vast quantities of power to use the empower for the, the, the stuff. It is a sad, sad thing. And. Uh, Oh yeah, Nonsanity joined the stream or joined the, the the server. I need one, two, three more of these LV um, relays, relays, connectors. I need connectors. So let's LV, and I will sleep and see. Oh, see, that was fast. Virtual Greg to the win for the win. All right, so LV. I need some LV wire coil. That's just copper around a stick. Alrighty, and then here's the connector. So copper redstonia and some hardened clay. I think I still have some hardened clay. Copper. No, I think I've got plenty of wire. Yeah, I've got plenty of wire. So let's go ahead and grab the hardened. If not, I can make hardened clay. So, one of the things I do like about IE, um, the, in, in, there is my hardened clay, uh, is that I can move the cables through solid blocks. That I, I do like. I think that is a, a good thing. Uh, and I'm over here because I no longer need to be over here. And speaking of which, the cable back here to the greenhouse popped off, 
but I think I snagged that in there and I've got plenty of this coal dust here. I don't know if I need to have this running for the nonce, so we just don't need it to, to be doing anything. That will slowly power down as it runs out. Later, of course, there's always going to be more um, that I need to do. All right, so I've got that uh, redstonia. Do I have any redstonia? I think I burnt up the last I had, so let's go ahead make a, a bit of it and toss you there no I wanted to run up not look at my inventory all right so let's go ahead and make some capacitor not capacitors connectors uh, that can make me let's do four that's probably all I need for for right now and then I need to make some wire I have no sticks on me but that's okay oh no 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 no! I need to make this curly wire which is using shears and stuff so wrong wire darn it all right I've got shears here I've got those cutters there I'm gonna need some blocks so I've got uh, copper here. Let's do, uh, that makes one. So I'm gonna need a bunch of copper plates. Let's make at least eight. So, alrighty, ready. All right, so I need to make flattened bits of that. And I've got lead on me still. Uh, I'll dump the, the lead in here. How is this doing? Lead, lead, lead. Gold. Gold's always nice. Lead, 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 gold, lead. All right. That's slowly processing through. And how are we doing power-wise? Yeah, so I, I can't see how else it's doing, but we definitely are doing nicely there. Even though we've got this is running, uh, this is occasionally running. The blast furnace or electric furnace in the background there is, is working. Uh, the macerator is working, and now I've got my metal former working. So, you know, even though I've got 32 RF or 16 RF, uh, not RF, uh, EU coming in, I still am able to hold it because I've got the bigger enough uh, piece on that. So, yay, 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 yay. So, let's go ahead. I've got five. I need these to be done and here's the thing if we look at getting this fully done here then that means I can go to the next age the farming age I need to make this casing thing and that's from forestry so if we look at that casing uh, this one right here, the sturdy casing. So I need to make this. To make this, I need the empowerer. Bronze gear, bronze item casing, casing, and a bronze plate, and a bronze large plate here. So that's a lot of bronze, because this is bronze and that's steel. So let's go ahead and at least get that going while this is doing stuff over here. Okay, let's get distracted and make this first. Don't, oh, it does use durability. Oh, okay, I was I was thinking that it wouldn't, because the last time I was playing with it, it, it didn't. So, let's see. Uh, what are people arguing about in the chat? Uh, so yes, there are a bunch of people that come from all sorts of different uh, countries. Um, England, yay for England. Uh, I lived there in the Englands, uh, in the Englands. <laughs> I lived in England uh, near Norwich when I was a kid and then later up near Dundee in Scotland. And uh, that was when my dad as an Air Force pilot was ex on exchange with the RAF. And uh, so that was, that was fun times, fun times. I, I really did enjoy being there. Um, let's see, uh, Netherlands, enjoyed being there at the Netherlands. Um, the IE press plate for gears to save on copper as soon as I can. You know, I hadn't thought about that, but that's definitely a, a good idea. Uh, if I can make it from there, let's see. Uh, nope, there's the press plate, just bronze. 
that would definitely save me on the steel. That would definitely save the steel. Now, to make this is going to take some steel, <laughs> but if I make one, I've made the same same stuff. So, yes, uh, making this metal press is definitely a good idea. I think for right now, I'm going to go ahead and just make the, the, the one of these through here just because I can. Uh, so that means I need one, okay, it was four steel, yes, mined like a steel trap. So four steel, it was the copper that I couldn't remember in the center. Copper, let's grab a steel. Oh, uh, also talking about uh, Europe, oh, I've got 10 steel on me. Um, talking about Europe, I graduated from high school in Germany. So. Uh, the, those years were, let's see, that would be in about 1718 or so, and uh, graduated from, from high school there. Let's see, what else went on? Um, that there, that there. Uh, means that I have absolutely zero chance of having a high school reunion, and so I've completely ignored any, you know, people wanting me to, to do a high school reunion, because where I'm or you know nobody's heading back to um, to, to Germany to do that so um, and and the Netherlands is very pretty I, I spent a bunch of time going there uh, all over the the area there in in uh, Europe and had all sorts of fun um, I do know some German the Unfortunately, my speaking of German and listening to German and reading German is really, really bad. I graduated from Hanau American High School uh, because it was part of the, uh, the 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 military base there. And let's see, uh, would have been quite a few years ago. So uh, trying to remember if it's right now. It's been over thirty years. So my, my German is extremely rusty because I haven't really used it. I've used my Spanish far more than, than my German. And why am I coming over here to look at stuff? I have no idea. Uh, I need to make more bronze. I've got this, this, this. I need to make this bronze plate. So bronze is tin and copper, but uh, what's the... I'm trying to remember the order in which uh, I should always just go instantly to the alloy smelter. Yeah, it's 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 one to three. So I need uh, tin. Oh, let's go ahead and make lots because we can. One, two, three. Dunk. All right. So if we're doing Where'd my tin go? So if we're doing four tin, that means I need 12 copper. All right, I can math. Let's see if, if that actually turned out to be the case. Uh, let's see. You know, it's one of those things that when I'm doing tons and tons of smelting and making stuff, I remember these alloys, and then within a very short amount of time, I forget what the, 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 the or I, I remember it's one to three, but is it more tin or more copper? Or, yeah, I don't remember. Yeah, it's, it's a terrible, terrible thing. I need to get rid of this and grab that and put that large press plate. It's a good thing I, I actually went ahead and made this um, tool forged so I can make and use these things because it's it's nice to have that stuff so bronze yeah I've got enough bronze for right now and so while we're doing that I should have been uh, coming over here and putting these guys on here so these would be getting some power at this point all right so you connect there to there and you connect to there to there and then you connect from there to over there and the nice thing about this is this works even at night. So that's that's very, very nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. So let's pull this out of the way. Uh, we could can't do it from down below anymore. I actually have to come up to see these things. 
All right, so we need one of you, one, two of you. Where's my gear? Gear goes here. So I need just that final piece in the center and has that finished cooling because it takes these things like forever to cool. So let's plop you back there, put you back on. How much bronze is left? Eight ingots. Good. Let's go ahead and process that. And let's toss this back on. And this thing here, two million RF to make. That's going to take a bit <laughs> of uh, time to do. So this has got half a million RF there, and these other ones have like nothing. <laughs> yeah, they have nothing in here. Oh, I wonder if the stuff above is getting power. Do those display stands hold power? They do. Ah, okay, so that's what's happening right now. That's why it looked like there was so little. All right, well, the nice thing about this is this will take forever and five days to do, but it will just keep going. That's the very nice thing. As long as I've got that water wheel below, it will just process and process and process and, and life is good. So this means I've got this piece here. This will make my sturdy casing for the tier uh, for age five, but I don't have two million RF and it's going to take a while for that to come in. So let's go ahead and make some more power. And then the nice thing, and I'm taking this from, from Nonsanity, is being able to look from below and see with those beams that this is actually still running and so I know it's still happening I just need to make sure I do not right click this ever or it'll pop out and all the power that's been used up to that point is gone alright so I, I wonder you know I could put copper wires um, between these four and that should do absolutely nothing no, I was thinking it would it would balance the, the power inside the capacitors, but these are all ins and not in outs and stuff like that, so no problem. All right, Heinz just said a bunch of stuff in German. Uh, so I remember about a third of that German, which is a terrible thing, but talking about uh, being a, a student. Alrighty. Um, yeah, talking about uh, going to school and, and uh, learning and, and gaining knowledge, all great stuff. But there's also a bunch of knowledge that can be gained by, you know, as, as Neocortex is saying, doing an apprenticeship. Because learning electronics, people need electronics. Um, plumbing, uh, electric, electricians, all of those, you know, people doing construction. Tons of people need that that uh, that work done, and uh, it it's makes good sense to uh, spend some time because people that are plumbers and professional electricians can make lots of money uh, doing that job because you know people don't like to actually do uh, uh, you know deal with uh, dirt and and uh, water and stuff like that. Uh, if you want to go into plumbing, there's only two rules you need to remember. One water rolls downhill and two it's not all water so now you know I actually had some some um, relays and and uh, connectors there so that's good we'll, we'll use those for a bit so um, more power we need more power so I don't need to do casein I don't need to do LV anymore thermoelectric this is the next little piece here that that needs to be done this uh, steel got that copper coil block. Okay, so that's going to need making a bunch of these. Alrighty, so uh, again, this would be something I could get much more. Again, steel. I should really look at making one of these metal presses because that will save me half of, of you know, I can double my, my copper use and get rid of all the steel from the other. So, yeah, smash right there fantastic person because he knows his electricity and we appreciate him for that so I need to go ahead and hammer out more copper that's bronze let's go ahead uh, let's see this needs 4 times 8 quick math that's 32 of these so let's go ahead and grab all 32 of those 
that's a good point. The metal press requires heavy engineering block, and I'm going to horribly mangle your name, so I apologize already. Um, Mindaugas? Mindagas? Mindaugas? Mindaugas? When I see something to pronounce, I try to pronounce it Spanish, because that was the, the last language I learned. And so let's take a quick look down that, uh, that loop. Uh, copper wire, metal press to make. Why am I not? All right, let's do it here. Metal press to. That's got to be all the other blocks and stuff in there. So, yes, it's a multi block structure. So, there's all these various pieces, and he's pointing out that uh, uh, it needs solarium, which means Ender IO, which I think is age six. Yeah, five. So we need to hurry up, go get through the farming age so we can get into the ender age so that we can make some of these alloy smelters. Um, and if we take a look at, so they're saying, you know, alloy smelters aren't that expensive. Well, let's take a quick look. Alloy smelter. To make an alloy smelter, we've got all these bits and pieces here. Um, vanilla, vanilla. This one here makes gets me into age five and I need a carpenter to do this and make more of these sturdy casings. So I'm gonna be chewing through a lot of steel. Let's see, the basic capacitor, this empowered Restonia enriched and the copper electron tube which needs the thermionic fabricator. So that's yet another piece from, from um, uh, forestry that needs to be made. Uh, copper, that's, that's not bad. See, now this is interesting, I can make uh, only using redstone ingots is correct. So this is the only way. I've got to make the redstone ingots. This one does not work, even though it says it does. Yeah, so I can only do it with this. Alrighty, so uh, yeah, that's that's a rabbit hole that uh, I, I am unprepared to go down at this point. So back to the thermionic uh, generator. To get this to work, I need some constantine. Constantine is what? Where do I get the Constantine? Yeah, thank you. Constantine grit. No, I need to make the Constantine. Oh, okay. Nickel grit and so it's nickel and copper. Can I just cook together nickel and copper or do I have to grind them up first? Looks like I can only grind them up. All right, all right. Well, the good news is I have some nickel. There's my iron. Uh, I need to do some uranium pretty soon. Uh, let's stop that. No, I don't want the iron. I want to do uranium. Do I have uranium? Nope. Do I have... Oh, this is getting full. All right, let's pull out... Lead, lead, lead. Where's my nickel? Nickel. There's my nickel. I need to crush that and... Uh, I can do it also in the smeltery. I didn't think. Oh, I can do it in the smeltery. So, all right, let's do that. Nickel and now I'm drawing a black. Probably copper. You know, it's that mind like a steel trap. Nickel, copper. Yeah, nickel, copper. All right, so let's go ahead and what can I use nickel for? Nickel base. Uh, make it a mix. No, I'm not doing any of that yet. Uh, yeah, I don't need. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff that I'm not really needing nickel for. Let's go back to that nickel plate. Uh, mold. Yeah, I'm not using a bunch of nickel for right now, so I'm going to go ahead and I also still have. How much do I have? Nickel, 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 nickel. There, I've got 19 more ores. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, take all of my nickel and all of uh, the, the copper that I need and just make... Well, let's the before I, I... No, because I should be able to use this uh, generator. You know, I will want a bunch of these generators. So five, that will give me two, that will get me quite a few generators worth. So I'm going to go ahead and, and start this a going here. And yeah, that's the, the nuggets. Choo -choo. Take a little bit of time. 
All right, phone, stop chirping at me. Uh, don't care about those texts. They can go away. All right, so the idea is to get this thermoelectric generator. That will produce me some RF, uh, which would be would be good. Uh, oh, a comment of making a plate mold. Then I don't have to squish it uh, later. So uh, why am I looking over here? I need to go into here, aluminum brass. Just toss that in there. And then I need a plate of something. Do I have... That's why I was looking in here. I don't see any plates. Uh, let's do a copper plate because I've got lots and lots of copper. While that's going on, let's uh, push more stuff through. Because that would that would be a good thing to have is is have um, a a plate here. See, I could use a copper from here, and let's make a plate out of you, and we'll see if that works. Little kittens, you don't like the texture pack? Oh well, I'm glad you like me. Um, this texture pack is the um, the faithful. Oh, that's a whole bunch of copper plates in there. I forgot that I put. Oh, because I need to make the wire. That's why. So, why did blood get poured out? Oh no, that shouldn't have done that. I didn't want the blood to get poured out. Darn it. Oh well, so it is making uh, Constantine. Uh, no, 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 I don't want to do Constantine. I want to use the aluminum brass. And now this is half full of the stuff I needed for coagulated blood. Well, darn it. All right, so I want to take one of these copper plates. Ooh, that does seem to work. All right, let's go ahead and pour out. Let's triple check aluminum brass. That's aluminum brass. That can go in there. So uh, what, it, what is this texture pack? This is faithful. Uh, you can see this is a 32 um, by 32 texture. Uh, if we look at the this here, this uh, mineral uh, planks, that's a 16 by 16 texture. So many of these things have the the 32 bit texture, so they're a little bit smoother. Uh, and, and occasionally, things like the the mineral that doesn't have that texture is is not there. I I personally I prefer either playing vanilla with with no texture packs at all, or playing with um, uh, faithful because it's very much like vanilla, but it's just a, a little bit crisper. Uh, so I, I like that. Um, um, dum -dum. Um, so yes, I'm with the the thermo the the thermoelectric generator, um, as Mindigus is is pointing out. And I'm sorry about that. It, Thirty RF per tick if you have lava on one side and water on the other side. 40 RF if it's Eulorium Uranium, and with Plutonium it's 60 RF a, a second. But um, yeah, so that's that is what I'm going for is the the uranium. Uh, so we've got this uh, block of uranium I'll need to put to the side of that. Anyway, um, yeah, I I wish the 16 were were all the way there, but I I prefer the smoother look of having the the 32 bit. So those are the ones there. And then, you know, as soon as you start getting into the, um, the issue of, yeah, we got the Constantine, um, will you work? <laughs> it will not pour out the, uh, through the casting. It, it, it's been fixed so that it actually wants to be, uh, done through, uh, um, it wants to be done elsewhere. So can I, I'll pour out the Constantine ingots here and then we'll do that. Uh, ice pillars, ice pillars. Um, ice pillars. What? Just a block of ice? Uh, is that what you're you're thinking? Uh, as opposed to water, or let's see, or is there something specific? Ice pillar. Oh, so yeah, you you so just ice, huh? Eh, that's very interesting. I take the ice, chisel it, and that way it won't melt. That's very interesting. So instead of 40 RF, it's going to be slightly more. Uh, very cool. Now the question is, where is there a cold biome around here? 
Uh, there's some cold up here, so I could freeze some ice there. Yeah, it's all deserty stuff down around here. So, uh, yes, I'm. I'll, I'll make some ice uh, later, but for right now, we'll just do. Um, we'll just do it with uh, the, the 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 water. And uh, but that's that's a good good idea. So, oh, packed ice. Oh, packed ice. That would be cool. Um, actually, Brad, you don't have to have silk touch to get the ice because what you do is you freeze the water and then you use chisel and bits and chisel and bits it. Oh. Throw snowballs in a compressor, that's true. Let's go back. Snow will get me, and I've got the compressor, and I can get the snow very, very easily. But you can chisel ice into one of these other pieces, and that'll dis disappear. Or you can use chisel and bits and take one bit out, and then you can break that block, put the, the block minus the bit down, and then put the bit back in, and it turns back into whatever it was you grabbed. You can grab anything that way. So I'm going to take a quick drink. All right. Mm. All right. Yeah, if you've never tried talking for two hours straight, you really should. <laughs> See if that works. Um, yes, pure daisy down um, by packed ice. Uh, that'll, that'll get it. Except um, there is no magic in this, this pack. So, so there's no botania or any of that uh, joyous stuff. Uh, now, can I make this? No, it definitely wants the plates. So, okay, we'll we'll go ahead and take the plates we've got or the the ingots we've got, and we'll move them over to here. Make sure it's on rolling, because <laughs> I've already made too many of these stupid cables for that. All right, what are you guys doing? You're working on iron, which is good because I definitely need more iron. Uh, let's see, you know, I, this this is full up here of a lot of stuff. Ah, Yalorium, I need one of these because I need to make a block of either Yalorium or Uranium, and that will be on the one side, and the water, and later it'll be ice, will be on the other. So... Uh, yeah, Daniel, yes, Botania is a tech mod. It just doesn't look like a tech mod. But uh, I've been really having fun with the the, the, the nuts and bolts uh, pack. I, it's been a blast. I'm, I'm building my base currently and uh, just, just going nuts, leveling down a, a small hill. And why am I looking here? I should be looking up here. So there's my five that I need. So and I've got steel. Let's go ahead and grab that steel right now. And again, I've got my 10 steel here, and I keep forgetting why I need that. So I'm going to move it out, so I will uh, come back here again later and uh, grab it. So uh, then I need, I've got the copper, because that needs to be turned into the the wire. And how well with my, oh, still, still surviving, that's good. Let's turn that into, do, 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 do. let's make another set. I need one more because I need eight of these. No hammer. This will give me. Ah, come on. This will give me. Oh, I keep forgetting. This gives me four at a time. Well, that's okay. I will be using these. Uh, let's hold off on on that. I will use that. Uh, okay, so this goes around something in the center. What was going in the center? An ori crystal. I believe I have an ori he said incorrectly. I have no anori, so let's go ahead and make one. And then I think I'm we're gonna have more power coming in. Where's my iron? Zap. Uh, you know I'm I'm worried if I zap myself here too many times I'm gonna get cancer or something with that laser. I, I just wonder and that, that would be a bad thing. So, all right, let's uh, make that block, and then we surround it with these guys there, and then we need the three steel. And there's my thermoelectric generator. Nice, nice, nice. Now I need some water. In fact, there's water downstairs, so I don't care. I need some connections. So let's not look there. Let's look up here. I need a connector and a wire and then probably have to break more blocks down there. Let's take a look. 
Do, 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 do. All right, so let's take this water bucket. There, so now I've got water. <laughs> and I already put a bucket down for that. Let's, you know, I could put it down right here for the, no, actually I put it right here so it's right below that. So let's do that for right now. Okay, so, and I, I need to make a much nicer looking array. So let's put water there, DeLorean block goes there, my generator goes there. Now this should be generating stuff right now, shouldn't it? Delorium. Oh, it's two sides? I always thought it was one side, but okay, so two sides, which means that can't work right where it is. So I need another uh, block of Delorium, that's for sure. Let's go ahead and do this. All right, so let's put the thermionic generator there, and let's put water there, water there, put a uh, bit of alabaster there, block that off. Okay, so now I need another bit of Eulorium, because I've fortunately got enough. Let's snag that. Oh, while we're doing it, let's put this in place. Gdoink. Whoa! Good. See, that, that shows it's got power, but this is showing nothing here. Huh. Funky. Alright, so, uh, let's go ahead and wire this up if we can. Boink. What? What do you mean I can't connect the wire there? I should be able to connect it there. Unless... It's because it needs that it, that connector piece. Alrighty, that relay. That's annoying. So I've got another one of the relays here, so we're good with that. And I'm gonna need an extra cable here. All right, let's make another Eulorium block, and that should be here. Do, do, do. Uh, wrong thing. That thing. So there's the Eulorium. That should hopefully get us going then. So Jonathan Smith says that we could do three groups of sides. So you've got the, the left, right, front, center, and then up and bottom by using phantom faces. That's a cool idea. I think that is a very cool idea. So... Should that not be generating stuff right now? As I understand it, that should be doing it right now, but I don't see anything in there. Or does this need the 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 the, the other type of, of uranium? I've got that other type, but uh, that that's strange. So let's. Now, if I put the... No, I need the relay. Can I put... No, relay doesn't uh, receive power. So if I doink that there, then I can go doink to there. So there's that. And then this would need to go to that relay. And then both of those would go up to the one above as I understand it. That. Hup. I'm in the water. Yep. And then you to there. And that should be transmitting. You know, it it looks like it does. Her. Her. Okay, so it this this looked like it powered up right away. So that that's very nice. Alright, so let's uh go up and take a look at what's happening here. Hey, that's done. Are you done? You can't be done. That looks like it's done. That's 2 million RF. I can't believe that we've gone through that fast with 2 million RF. But you know what this means? This means that we can go ahead and uh, upgrade to the next age. Well, let's do that.
So we'll just spit that out on the ground and walk over it. Ta-da! Age four! Yay! I, I didn't expect to, to do that today, but I am okay with that. Let's come over here and plop that right there. Doink! Yay! Okay, uh, that's amazing. That's amazing. I, I, I completely thought that it would take far more for time to, to process that. So, yay! Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and uh, hold on to that. I'm going to, I can foretell that I'm going to be needing to make great galloping gobs of these sturdy casings for other um, machines. So let's see, forestry, forestry, lots, no, I'm not going to be making a mailbox or a trade station. No, not going to be happening. Bottler, I will definitely be making a carpenter. Uh, I will probably be making a centrifuge. Uh, there, there's... Um, definitely a squeezer. There's there's several things that I'm definitely going to be be doing. Uh, the I I need the thermionic fabricator that's used to too many too many pieces. So, all right, all right. So um, that is fantastic. Uh, let's see. Uh, Daniel's asking, are the ages global or local? They are local. They are for the 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 person individually uh, who's doing this. So. I just barely, if we take a look at the guide here, I just barely uh, accomplished uh, age four. Four got uh, this age, eight, uh, going. And then uh, Wild, I think it was yesterday or day before, got to age 13. And we've been saying, hey, aren't you done with the age 14 yet? <laughs> so, yeah, I'm, I'm really glad to get this. I didn't think that uh, we'd be getting this because of lack of... Uh, of power, but uh, no, that water wheel has slowly but steadily generated enough power for us, which is fantastic. But now we've got the thermion, not the thermion, yeah, thermionic generator is is a uh, is generating more power, which is fantastic. And even though it's a tiny trickle, it's storing it into five massive batteries. And I think that's 2 million RF in each one of those batteries, if, if I remember right. So having the trickle is okay because I've got batteries to store that. And definitely look at um, doing some other things to increase the storage. I think we're good as far as the EU behind me and for the, the RF stuff over there. I was looking at uh, rearranging that, but I may do that off camera. Uh, plus I need to process a ton of stuff there. Anyway, oh, 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 and Kyoto mentions there's also the storage of 180, uh, 800K RF in each one of those display stands. So they can have a nice little buffer there, and that's why having the, the capacitors underneath them uh, adds to the speed for processing that. So anyway, I think we're done really well. Thank you so much for, for hanging out here. Um, your, your comments have been greatly appreciated. Uh, captured a lot of uh, things that needed to be done and caught me making a couple mistakes but uh, we tried a few things and, and found some uh, good stuff too ah thank you thank you thank you for for joining me on the stream and i'm not sure when the next stream possibly monday possibly tuesday uh i'm not sure i'm not sure uh, i tend to send out uh, the an announcement uh, at least two hours maybe sometimes three beforehands uh, just so that you get a, a better chance to, to know when things are happening. Uh, if you're in the Discord channel for FTOG, I will post them there, and you can always ask because several people have asked that way. Uh, but, yep, successful stream, successful bit of work here, and many, many thanks for your comments. Anyway, this has been Grok the Duck Farmer here on the Age of Engineering server, and I got to age four. Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.